New tonight, an 11-year-old Valrico boy is back on the field playing, following a close call with the lightning strike. You probably remember this story we first brought you about Levi Stock in July. Following a day on the boat with his family, they will never forget, especially his father. Fox 13's Jordan Bowen caught up with them for an inspiring update. Their experience is encouraging others to always be prepared. This is for defense, and I really like defense. Eleven-year-old Levi Stock, who lives for the game, is now finally getting back to playing. I really just had to lay in bed, and I couldn't really run around and stuff, and I like to run. Back on June 30th, he and his family were enjoying an afternoon on their boat. They were in the process of docking at the Williams Park boat ramp on the Alafaya River when a lightning bolt struck Levi. Thank goodness that I was facing forward and we were focused on getting to the dock that I saw the strike go through him and then him go into the river and then just uh, jumped in right away. Derek Stock pulled his son, who was unconscious, out of the water and immediately began CPR, something he knows from his training working at Tampa Electric. His eyes were rolled back and... Um, I could tell he wasn't breathing, um, so I just started CPR right away, and then they took us to the beach and got us on shore, and you know, kind of felt like an eternity. But like she said, it was four minutes, and then Hillsborough County Sheriff's showed up and administered an AED. Levi was rushed to Tampa General Hospital, where he spent the next five days. Miraculously, he didn't suffer any permanent brain damage. Photos show the strike entered his lower back, went down his leg, and exited through his foot, avoiding all of his major organs. The first month was rough just with the pain the nerve pain really in his legs it would be months before he could run around again this month his mom Kristen stock says he's feeling 95 percent back to normal he's been able to play lacrosse it's just building his muscle strength back up and working back up to what he could do before like running around with his siblings his nine-year-old sister ivy witnessed it all i remember turning to at look, looking at my dad and him yelling Levi and seeing him jump in the water after him and Levi's leg turning black. But now thankful her big brother is nearly recovered and glad her dad was there to jump in and save him. A lot of uh, folks in, in different departments were asking me to speak and just uh, talk on the importance of CPR. Stock now gives PowerPoint presentations on his experience to Tampa Electric employees about what to do in the case of a lightning strike and how to give CPR. The family says the support from the community has been what's helped that make it through this difficult recovery process. As for Levi, his whole family was there to witness as he took his first steps on the field. It was neat to see and just um, see how far he came. And now, you know, watching him run around and play, it's just, it's a lot. Very thankful for that. Reporting in Valrico, Jordan Bowen, Fox 13 News.